Hey guys, it's Michelle. Welcome to my channel, Grateful Creations. Well, I am going to do a scoop and drag tonight. And I am, oh, it's a little chilly out. I kind of like this time of year because I can keep the windows all open, which is, um, it's, that's cool. I like doing that. Oh my goodness. This is Waterfall by TLP. It's one of their new colors. I love it. I did uh, another painting. It was a pearl pour with the waterfall. It's a little bit on the thick side, so I'm adding some Jusania and all of these products you can get on the Fluid Arc um, Co. site. And I'll link that in the description. The, <laughs> from these, I love these little cups. These are so, I love them. I just love them. And that is the right consistency. I do like my paints thick. And we also have Deja Vu from TLP, also a brand new one. I love this color. This is a violet opaque color. It's very, very cool. Um, I haven't seen anything like it. And this is also TLP. And it is Twinkle. That's not Twinkle, that's Glisten, but it is Twinkle. <laughs> it's a violet shift. It's beautiful. I have to look at that. Just gorgeous. And oh, <clears throat> this is Studio Acrylics Blue Black mixed with uh, Windsor Newton Windsor Violet. Really pretty. And I'm trying, oh, this is a custom color. I there's a lot of different colors in here. It, the, mainly, it is the Pepio Acrylics in green, green blue, iridescent green blue, not blue green, green blue. And I have added like um, just a dollop of teal by Golden to make it opaque because I don't have too many opaques in here. And what else? What else is in there? I put some glisten in here too. That's why it's out. Glisten. <laughs> and I have pillow paints. Oh, I'm sorry. My cell activators are black. It's, uh, I don't think this is oxide black. I think it might be, it might be lamp black. And doo -doo 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 -doo. also I have this gold. Now my, Australian Floetrol was getting very, very watery. And um, I just did an experiment on mixing half US Floetrol and half Aussie Floetrol, and it tended to work pretty good. My pillow paints, I have two, two pillow paints tonight. Yes, 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 yes. I have Sherwin-Williams in Tricorn Black. This is a color to go. I also have PPG. Um, and this is the PPG Multi Pro. This stuff is lovely. It's just, oh. So what I'm gonna do, I know Jessica Winterstrom usually puts the black on top. I'm putting the black on the bottom. I'm using two pillow paints and a lot of times she does faux pillow paints, faux pillows. And I just, for some reason, I, it just happened to work out. Um, I was just playing around and I, um, I used two pillow paints and it looked, it turned out pretty good. And I did a scoop and drag and that turned out pretty good, probably because these paints are on the thick side. I think that's kind of one of the requirements. You have to have pretty thick paints. So I'm just going to spread that along 
And then I'm putting my PPG right on top of it. These are both thick. There we go. Oh, it's chilly. <laughs> I guess I could put some clothes on. Whoa, there we go. And I'm gonna do a swipe. I wanna make sure I've got enough paint off so that it doesn't. And I actually, I pinned this right to the spinner, but I can lift it to do. Do you want some negative space? Space? That's pretty cool. Let's do it again. Maybe we'll do black this time, then gold, and then I'll start I'll do a third one with gold and then black. Black. just watched her video about layering. I hope I do you proud, Jess. You know, I have her <laughs> spinner and I also have um, Erica's spinner and for some reason I always think that it's kind of like a really nice dress you don't want to <laughs> use it unless you're doing something really special but these quite frankly they are bigger and um, I just need to I don't know I just feel like they're too special to, to use on this I don't know why and here's the last swipe No idea how this composition is going to work out. We'll figure it out. Very cool. Oh my god, I'm just like, ah, like a little kid. You always wipe off your uh, swiping tool or scoop and drag tool in between. Oh, this is too much fun. <laughs> it's like the crack of ass right now. I think it's it's five o'clock in the morning.
looks like it looks like two eyes and some teeth right there. <laughs> Here we go. start spinning this to see what happens with it and looks like there's a whole lot of paint on here anyway so let's do it Yeah, there's a lot of paint on here, so I do have to stretch quite a bit of it off. Oh, I need to get some, I need to get a sweatshirt on. It was, oh, I know I should not be complaining. You guys are probably in a lot worse. All right, guys, I'll give it a few more minutes. It looks like we've got a constellation happening here and I'll be back to show you the dried, or dried, the wet results. All right, I'm trying something new. <clears throat> I saw a little dot there, so I tried to hit it, but I could see the black coming through. And actually, that's what's happening here. The black is coming through from underneath, so I wanna do something to camouflage that. So what I'm gonna do is drag this color down and through it. Let me hold on to this so it doesn't Well, that didn't really work. That's as much as I'm going to do. Well, ah, punch. You know what? I'm going to have to swipe it with... Fudge, 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 fudge. 
I'm gonna do the gold and the black again. It's gonna appear to be, oh, I can always put other colors on top of it, duh. So I've got the gold and the black. And what colors do I really want to come through there? How about that purple? Oh, burr. And I'm gonna do three, three colors. The purple, the deja vu and custom turquoise blue and I'm coming through here I can't believe I'm doing this after it's stretched out Ooh. and I left half most of the paint on here <laughs> still that's cool sound just like a teenager. Oh, well, how, where have you been all night? <laughs> Row! Once it comes up a little bit, I'm going to give it another quick spin, but I don't want to take, I don't want a lot of that to come off now, because now I'm really liking it. Oh, happy accidents, they happen. It just takes longer for the cells to come up with both fl uh, flow trials. So I know why Jess puts the uh, black on top and the white on the bottom, um, so that the white comes up, I guess. I don't know. I just thought putting the white on top gives the colors um, more vibrancy. So I'll have to try it the other way around too. Oh, my teeth are chattering. It's not even that cold here, I'm sure. I'm from Canada, hello. But <laughs> living here for a long time, <laughs> 20 years. Uh, yeah. Oh, guys, I am loving this. It looks like that's a fish. Oh my goodness. All right, I love paint reactions. Here we go again, eh? And these are starting to get some dimension. I'm gonna let it sit for a few minutes before I take you down. I'll be back. All right, guys. I love these colors. And I'm starting to figure out the scoop and swipe. Wow. So the black is coming up underneath, <clears throat> from underneath. right there, which I don't mind at all. So the combination of the, oh, look at that right there. Oh, the deja vu and the waterfall is gorgeous. And then the, um, look at that, there's the twinkle. You can tell, yeah, twinkle, twinkle, little star. Very cool. 
And then here's my little guy here. I could have stretched him out, but I kind of like him the way he is. <laughs> gonna keep him. <laughs> yeah, he looks like a shark. So right here is, I think that's that the purple. Yeah, that it, it's made out of the um, blue black and the Windsor Violet. I'm not sure, I think these are start, the cells are starting to break up a little bit, which I'm sad about. Or maybe I just stretched it too much, I'm not sure. But I've been having issues with my Australian Floetrol, so it's an experiment to try to mix the two. This is really pretty right there. Oh my God. Oh, I love that. Just love it. Mm. Next time, more negative space but I do enjoy the colors. It's a little feast for my eyes. And there's that little constellation that's coming through from underneath. That is so cool. All right, I'm pretty happy with this. Can you tell? <clears throat> so please check out Jessica Winterstrom's channel. She is the master of these. And uh, I learned everything I know from her. <laughs> Oh, on a scoop and drags. Yeah. So, please be safe and create. Please like, share, and subscribe. Ciao for now. Hey guys. So this is like two days later and it's almost dry. I was almost gonna paint over that part there and I, yeah, no. So, really see the bling. No resin. I'm pretty happy. Now I did add some Joa or and some water to the the deja vu, so I think that's why I've got a little bit of I don't know if that's splitting or what. But um, yeah, I made it way too thick. I tried using. Josonia triple thick in the um, pigments, some of them, and yeah, no, don't do that. <laughs> so there's the pretty much dried result. And uh, yeah, here we go.